I think this about says it all for me. When the level of our awareness changes, we start attracting a new reality. And that is why there is no going back. When, we, when our consciousness comes to new insight, when our horizons have formed anew, the one thing we know about evolution is it's irreversible. There is no going back. You had only to, you know, to take a look in your own lives. When, you, you, when you've had insights, you know, when you've um, had new ideas, you can't let them go. You, know, you can let them go, but they have changed you. You are a different person because of them. And that's what we're saying today, that um, religiously, we're, we're still, in a sense, grappling with this. Uh, we are, in a sense, um, being pulled in, two di in, in different ways. The church is, is you know, basically saying, this static worldview is, what's it about. It is what we're about. And the rest of us is saying, science and culture and, and the changing world itself is saying, no, there's something new and interconnected, and our awareness is changing. And so our challenge in our time will be to be attentive to the new awareness of our lives and then to ask, what does that mean for where I am going, for what I believe in? What will be worth my life in the days and years ahead?